guys what's up good morning um so today is a wednesday and i'm gonna kick off a vlog today but it's kind of a different vlog this is i literally have no better way to explain what this is than to say it's a health vlog um that's literally as best as i can explain it i am in my pajamas it's in the morning and um i think it's like eight and basically the reason why i'm saying this is a health vlog is because i'm going to be talking all things health i'm going to be vlogging um what i do since the gym has been open and since i'm back training my trainer is back and i'm back on a regular schedule so things are back to normal um but i wanted to like share with you guys what i've been doing what's been making me feel better what's been helping me get into a routine and yeah basically like all stuff health basically um i've got a couple goals that i want to reach before december so i just thought that it would be beneficial for me to bring you guys along just for today um vlog me going to the gym what i do before gym prepping um what i've been eating just stuff like that the first thing that i have to do is i have to take off my waist trainer so i do something illegal right i waist train when i'm sleeping i know that's like super bad or whatever whatever but if i was conscious of the fact that i'm waist training i wouldn't waist train nearly as much and it actually is kind of comfortable um because i do the cling wrap method i'll show you guys everything that i'm talking about and i kind of i've done it for so long that in my sleep if i'm uncomfortable i can unwrap the um, the waist trainer not necessarily to take it off but it's got two layers so i just take the first layer off and it's just way more comfortable and i can just sleep um and i do that in my sleep <laughs> i that's how long i've been doing it and it works so so well because i do it for way longer um way longer than i would if i was actually awake and i was like conscious of the fact that i'm waist training and yeah it's just i don't know it works so i've got to take it off i want to show you guys what i do and what the cling wrap method is so let me stand up so literally underneath my pajamas is my waist trainer so and then yeah this is my waist trainer this is the what's this called it's called a hot belt something something um i got this from game it was like 300 rand i got it online so i will try link this down below it is from game though uh so yeah it's got this first layer so this is how the waist trainer looks and then take this off and then take that off and then that's my waist so you see the first layer that i took off that's what i normally take off in my sleep and then when i wake up i just redo it for a while and then i'll take off uh the rest of the waist trainer when i'm ready so this is the cling wrap that i was talking about and underneath this cling wrap is lotion before i go to sleep or before i put the waist trainer on i take like a lot of lotion and i like put it all over my tummy put it all over my tummy and then wrap cling wrap around my stomach that makes it a hundred times you guys it makes it a hundred times more comfortable because normally the boning and the wires in the waist trainer are what hurts you so it doesn't hurt because there's literally like a lubricant and an extra layer um underneath the waist trainer and literally it protects my skin so it's super comfortable um so yeah all i do in the morning is i take this cling wrap and i like put my nail through it and tear it like just tear it open and yeah literally that is it like that is my waist like yeah that's basically what i do i just took off that and i'm just gonna let it air out but yeah, that's basically what I do for my waist training. But you know how you've got like, everybody when they wake up has like a flat tummy. I kind of like to have that feeling linger for longer. And one thing I have noticed is I wake up much flatter when I stop eating at 8. Um, as compared to if I ate like at 11 or like later on. 
make sure that you stop eating much earlier so maybe like have your last meal at seven have your last meal at eight something like that it really really does help and yeah you just wake up much flatter and i also find that you're flatter for longer but also another thing that you can do in the morning other than the waist training other than the eating is acv acv actually really does work guys like i know it's got so much hype and i tried it like two years ago for the first time and i was like mm, am i even sure i even did a whole video on it so i will link that but I did that whole video and I was like, oh, is it worth it? Is it worth it? It is. Like, two years later, I will tell you that it really is. And low-key, you feel it work. Like, you have the ACV shots or whatever and it's just like, you feel your stomach. It feels like it's burning low-key. It feels like it's burning the fat. So, ACV does work. And also having a very light breakfast can help you feel flatter for much longer and... A very light breakfast that I'm obsessed with are smoothies because first of all you're getting all the nutrients you're getting all the fiber my smoothies are high key very high in fiber I don't use any milk in my smoothies mainly because milk is very bloating like it bloats you up so I don't use any milk I don't use any artificial powders I don't use any other powders you know those smoothie powders the protein powders whatever whatever I don't use any of those um, mainly because first of all i don't know which one to use i'm scared and then also because just like having natural smoothies is just so much easier for me like all you do is go to the grocery store and you've got your smoothies so mine are very very high in fiber because i use a whole apple in one smoothie mix a whole banana like bananas and apples are so high in fiber and then i add scoops of muesli so they're super super high in fiber and pro tip guys this might be tmi but this is the truth the way that you keep a flat stomach is to increase your metabolism and to increase your metabolism is to have like higher things in fiber or whatever um, or to eat things that are higher in fiber and to make sure that you poop regularly. It's a pro tip. You'll weigh less. Guys, I'm being serious. Like, Let me tell you. Let me tell you. Everybody that wants to lose weight has to make sure that they poop more. Like, it's... Like, I'm being dead ass. Like, I'm being so dead ass. You can't carry around that weight. You can't have food in your stomach that has not left for four days or something like Like, literally. And I know it's harder for girls because a lot of us have slower metabolism. So, it's not, you know, it's not as easy. But try to increase the fiber that's in your diet. So, having the apples, having the bananas, having the muesli, um, even having those uh those yogurts what are they called the green ones the ones that are super super high in fiber i forgot what they're called those stuff like stuff like that just really really high in fiber and like decreasing how much dairy and um i find that bread kind of clogs me up a bit so yeah i try not to eat as much bread i kind of substitute it with rice cakes i can't, literally i use rice cakes as my bread especially like in times so when I'm trying to lose more weight. So, yeah, guys, like, that's the truth. Like, if I'm being dead ass, take more dumps and you'll lose more weight. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, also, I find that ACV really helps with that. Like, ACV really does help push your metabolism and help you and helps you um, digest food much faster. Yeah, gents, that's basically it. Um, it's 8. I have gym at 11. Every time I go to the gym, I try to go at 11 a.m. Because the gym is not so full. I'm going to try and make detox water today. Because I low-key have not been having any citrus. Because I ran out of lemons for lemon water. I've had no lemon water all week. I've only been having ACV shots and smoothies. Because I've got no lemon. So I'm going to... I've got oranges so i'm going to make detox water i'm just going to chop up some oranges and put it in my water bottle and drink that and i'll even take that to the gym so yeah guys i think i've caught you up enough um let's go to the kitchen and let's make uh, our acv shots oh yes um shout out to you guys because i was actually taking my acv shot raw i would just shoot it up into my system but i have started diluting it the only thing i will say about diluting the acv shot is it makes it bigger so like there's more like the shot would be like just the shot now that there's water it's diluted so it's bigger so it's like longer it's like i can't take just one 
like shot i actually low-key have to drink it so ugh. but i will say it's easier to take now that i put some water in it so shout out to you guys for that tip um then i'm gonna make a smoothie and i'm gonna make my detox water so let's go to the kitchen and let's get this vlog started <laughs> get my laptop because it's really early so i think i might watch something because i only really have to start getting ready at half past oh my god i need my other battery at half past 10 okay guys so i am in my room now literally i got my laptop i've got my oranges i've got my smoothie my green smoothie and my detox water that has oranges in it as well and i'm just gonna chill for a while and yeah dude literally orange is honestly my least favorite fruit but i have no choice because i don't have any lemons um to put in my detox water or to have like citrus um i also haven't had green tea today because i ran out of honey so i basically have to go to the mall and that since it's level one i don't know what's happening at the mall gatawa <laughs> I don't know what's happening at the mall like at all so i haven't been to the mall since like level two obviously so i don't know but anyway i'll go i probably will vlog when i go probably like an errands with me because i do have a lot to get it's kind of sweet so that makes it taste a bit better i think the reason why i hate oranges is because most of the oranges i've ever had are like super super sour and i also just think it's a very hard fruit to eat but then you know what's so weird about going back to the gym for me it's because like my gym's not far from my house like at all i can walk to the gym it's literally like a five minute walk like five minutes but i walked the first day i went back to the gym i walked right i forgot because the last time i went to the gym was like last year well the last time i went to the actual gym with my trainer was last year because nothing has happened this whole year literally i realized when i went to the gym i was like actually nothing has happened this whole year like basically a happy new year no because nothing has happened all year anyway so yeah the last time i went to the gym was last year and i forgot that men are mad like i forgot that men are mad because i've been in the house so this five minute walk i could be saving money like i don't have to uber nothing i could just walk to the gym plus it works as a pre-workout and a post-workout like a, a cool down and a warm-up basically um that walk but on the way men on the way men and mind you i'm wearing like capri uh leggings with like a big ass t-shirt i'm holding a bag i look ratchet i've got a bandana on I look kiddo like I didn't even look cute at all but men men literally this one guy was like running towards me he was like yeah I like your ass I like your ass I'm like don't come near me like that's what I kept saying I was like don't don't come near me literally 
so yeah guys i was just like okay no and then like basically i came up with this whole thing where i'm just gonna uber like i'm gonna uber this five minutes because men like i'd rather that than to be harassed by fucking men on the street so yeah that's that's what my situation guys like men make a very simple task harder and it irritates me unfortunately we have to we have to move like i can't not go to the gym because of idiots you know what i'm saying so yeah it's nine so i've got an hour and a half to chill before i get ready for the gym and i'm just gonna watch some youtube um yesterday i've watched this video like a million times because manifesting but i watched britain nicole's um empty apartment tour and Kimang ashley Devana uploaded so i think i'm gonna watch this it's like a chit chat i love her i like her vlogs especially so we're gonna watch Enhanced this i will win so yeah this is what i'm gonna do but this is ashley Devana if you don't know this is her so i'm gonna watch her she's pretty insightful wait let me actually just <laughs> she's pretty insightful i like the way she thinks so i'll see you guys later let me just watch chill and all right guys so it's half past 10 i've started getting ready um i was watching some youtube videos i'm trying to okay okay so anyway um I was just chilling. I'm I'm looking for a fragrance. I want to buy another one, but I'm just like so confused. <laughs> so I've been doing my research and everything because you know, like I don't know if you're allowed to like go and smell fragrances yet. But all the ones that I do want to smell, I've never seen at stores. But then again, I haven't been to a perfume stand in so long, so there's also that. Anyway, let me get ready, guys. Um, I'm done with this, so I'm gonna go put this in the thingy in the sink and then I'm going to get ready, pick out something to eat to wear, pick out something to wear and make my way basically. So let's go. I didn't show you guys, but I got a new gym bag it's a really cute it's small which is great because i never have a lot of things in my gym bag and also i've got my towel in here but we're not allowed to use our towels at the gym i've got my mask and my card but this is such a cute little bag guys i'm obsessed with it um it's from max it's literally 100 grand i'll link it i talked about it on my instagram but i will link it i love it i love the pink it's a little barrel bag and it is in stock right now okay so i changed my top you guys just to something that i know i won't get as irritated with when i'm at the gym now i want to figure out my hair so i've been wearing bandanas to gym nothing crazy nothing special at all but then i got a delivery from eunice right and they have this wig that they've been promoting recently the headband wig and i was like this would be perfect for the gym because it has no lace you don't have to stick it down nothing you literally tie it onto your head and normally when i used to work out last year i'd have like um a lace front in right and i just take a tie and i tie my lace down but this wig comes like that so i was like okay i really want to try this so this is from eunice hair i've worked with them a million times i love their hair and you guys know i always say their quality is amazing so shout out to Yuna's hair for sponsoring today's video what comes in this package is pretty interesting obviously because i've never had a wig like this before so i'm not used to all of this but they gave me so many options for headbands got a leopard print one got a floral rose one i think this is another floral one um snake skin and then this plaid print and then i got a wig cap but i also got this nice little package that they gave me as well and inside is another wig cap um what's this oh nail foils they gave me nail foils you guys these blue nail foils interesting and then this is another head this is cute this headband has got like a scarf print on it and then they gave me lashes right here and then it just comes in this very cute little package that says Eunice 
and this is the wig i know that on the wig there's a black band which i think i will be using but it is pretty i actually really like this hair it's like a wavy this is actually perfect because i'm not trying to straighten the hair when i'm going to the gym you know what i'm saying so this is it let me open him oh this is interesting okay so um i think i'm gonna brush it out though get off me and yeah so this is the headband wig you guys so literally there is no lace like no lace whatsoever there's nothing instead there's this velcro tip right here just velcro tip and you just adjust it with the velcro like however tight you want it to be so there's no adjustable clips at all it's just this so this is a pop on your head wig. Oh, I'm not going to brush this out. I'm just going to do this with my hair and hands. This is stunning, guys. This is so pretty. So I'm going to put this on. And then, yeah, I'm going to put this on and see how this works for gym. This is the perfect errands wig now that I think about it. Like if I was to run some errands, I think this would be the perfect little wig for that. Okay, let me get my mirror so I can see what's happening. Okay. <laughs> this is so different. Okay. Okay. Okay, girl. I see. I see what you're doing. Okay. This is literally how I'd look going to the gym last year. Let me just pull it back. Like, literally, this is how I would look going to the gym last year. You don't have to do anything. Like, you don't have to do a thing. I think this is perfection and then i also like the curl like this loose wave because you don't need to brush it this is actually the perfect gym wig <laughs> this is perfect oh my god this is perfect thank you so much eunice this is actually ah! yes this is so cute this is perfect guys literally there's no lace on this wig. It's curly, so I don't even need a pot. It's just... This is cool. This is really cool. So, yeah, guys. You guys saw how it looked in the inside and everything. This is stunning. Where's my phone? I have to withdraw money so that I can buy my gym tag because I lost it. This guy is seven minutes away, and you know what irritates me about this? It's that during about he's seven minutes away, I could be walking to the gym and I would have made it by the time he comes here. But obviously, like I told you guys, I can't walk to the gym. I hate Ben. If I haven't said it before, I'm saying it again. I don't like you guys. You guys make everything difficult. And it's not even cute. Like, it's not banter. But yeah, anyway. You guys. <sighs> there are no drivers right now. Like, everybody that I keep requesting keeps saying 10 minutes. And like, when I tell you, it's like right here, guys. Like... I wish you understood. I told my 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 uh, trainer that can I come at twelve because there's no rides around me. I told him about the um, the incident yesterday, not yesterday, the last time I went to the gym. I told him that what that guy did. So he was like, okay, whatever my plan is, it's cool. So yeah, I'm annoyed. <laughs> Sorry, but anyway, I'm just going to continue what I was doing before I got changed. I was looking for a fragrance. I'm thinking about going for La Via Bell. Um, yeah, I'm thinking about La Via Bell.
Now I first want you to do a test run, just pedal. Yeah. Right, you're fine. Yeah, my okay. feet are also comfortable. It's fine. Okay, lovely. Okay. Now we're going to start. Okay. Resistance at one. No, no, just hold. Okay. Resistance at one. Speed at 70. 70. And okay. then 15 minutes, and then today we're gonna do some stomach and a whole lot of other exciting exercises. Are we going on the machine? Surprise. <laughs> <laughs> so basically, he wants me above 70 for 15 minutes and haven't even touched one. Oh, so apparently um, I got in here and he was like to me, Oh no, it's a good thing that you didn't come earlier. There was no electricity. I always tell you, like everything that's a setback, it's not really a setback. God is trying to save you from something. I would have been so demotivated if I came and there was no electricity. But yeah guys, this is how things are set up. Basically, um, I don't have anyone who stands or works out next to me. So this is basically how it works, like literally the two thingies next to me, nobody's allowed to work out next to me. And when you're on these type of machines, you can take off your mask, especially if there's nobody around you. But as soon as you go in an area, that's why I wanted to come at 11 because it's super, super empty. But if you're in an area where there's like a lot of people, then you have to wear your mask, even if you're on the treadmill. So that's why I chose a time where I know that there aren't a lot of people in the gym because nobody's trying to run beyond the elliptical on the bicycles with a mask on. Um, so yeah, there's literally nobody near me. Let me show you. Literally nobody is next to me. So, so yeah. And as I'm talking to you, I'm actually maintaining an 80, which is pretty cool. So yeah, let me work out guys and I will see you. Later. So he's like to me, um, I'm like, oh, are we gonna go to the machines? He's like, oh, I'm gonna surprise you. You know when your trainer says it's a surprise, you know it's never a good thing. So, girl, RIP. I'm so glad I didn't schedule work for today because I know I wouldn't have been grand. So yeah, let me get going because this camera is low-key burning my arm. So I'll see you guys later. guys so I did not realize that I deleted the outro clip so I had footage of where I did an outro just saying goodbye to you guys because I only vlogged one day um so now that I'm editing I'm literally finished with the editing I realized that I don't have any outro footage and I definitely remember taking outro footage so I don't know what happened I don't know what happened. Anyway, it's not that hectic. It's not that deep. I do want to just say goodbye to you guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I really did enjoy it. It was kind of different. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, wish me well on this journey, guys. Of me working out and everything. Oh my gosh, guys. My legs hurt so much. Um, but the reason why my trainer was saying it's a surprise was because it was leg day. And that day was leg day so i've been limping like walking really slow ever since and yeah that's basically it guys i'm just chilling now after i finish this video i'm gonna do thumbnails and i'm gonna chill i've been resting guys i've been resting i don't even when was the last time i went out like when was the last time i went out honestly so yeah guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video i really really hope you did and shout out to Eunice hair for sponsoring today's video because it was lit
i really really do recommend that you guys get that wig even if you don't like gym or like workouts i do recommend that wig because it is so so easy like i said i think it's a perfect erin's wig i think it's a very perfect like throw on and go wig you don't have to do too much to it and i think every girl needs at least one wig like that you know one that you don't have to straighten you don't have to curl as you saw those curls were like so easy i broke them with my nails i just i combed it with my hands literally and i just threw it on so yeah shout out to units that was a really cool unit um and yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in my next video Mwah. <laughs>